Purdue men and women's basketball were back in action, and both games really showed us what both teams are made of. We'll start off first with the men's basketball team, and J.D. Arland was in Bloomington and has all of the highlights from that game. One of the most competitive college basketball rivalries in the nation lives right here in Assembly Hall in Bloomington, Indiana. Purdue taking on the Hoosiers, looking to hand Mike Woodson and company their 10th straight loss to a Boilermaker team. All eyes on the main event in Assembly Hall. IU hasn't walked away from this one with a win since 2016. The McCutcheon alum would make a difference. Opening minutes of the game, Purdue doing what it does best. Mason Gillis, zero, cashes in from deep. Boiler shooting over 30% from beyond the arc on the evening. Travion likes that. Moments later, Williams fakes the screen. The Serbian sniper, cash money. Purdue doubles up Indiana. It's 16 to eight. Trace Jackson Davis in foul trouble. So the Hoosiers use the next man up. And that's the Maverick alum, Fennessy, Swish. You can hear that roar all the way back to the south side. Painter not exactly thrilled about that one. Boilermakers trail 37-28 at intermission, and here's where Indiana really turns up the volume. Xavier Johnson to race Thompson. One-handed jam. The crowd's loving it. Hoosier shooting a massive 43% from the floor. 68-65 the final. Boilermakers fall to 15-3 on the season. Painter on missed opportunities. You know, we were still in the game. I thought we played well in the second half. We just didn't reward ourselves by, by making our free throws. You go 7 for 17 from the free throw line, then you get into a possession game. You're definitely going to reflect back on that and, you know, want some of those free throws back. And so a change in coaching means a new outcome for the annual rivalry matchup. Indiana takes this one. The Boilermakers back in action this Sunday against Northwestern. Reporting in Bloomington, J.D. Arvin, Sports 18.